All you have to do is you have to educate the neighbor. You have to be nice to the neighbor. I have really cool neighbors on a lot of them. I'm like, look, if you want to go use the pool, go use the pool. You want friends that are coming into town, I'll block off that weekend for you. It's all yours. Because it, without them, and if things go wrong, I want them to call me. Right. And I, it is messed up, you know, if you bring in some nasty people into the neighborhood and they, they don't do the right thing. Right. So you got to be super careful to make sure that they're on board with it. Because I, I swear to God, I, I found this crazy house. And I was like, this is going to be a killer Airbnb. And I walked up and before I went into, I was under contract, actually. I walked over to the neighbor, I knocked on the door and he comes out. He's in a sheriff outfit. And he's like, yeah, I'm the local sheriff. I'm the, I'm the detective. And I was like, yeah, I'm not doing this here. <laughs> I, was like, uh, I was like, I'm going to do an Airbnb next door. What do you think? He's like, no shot. He's like, I don't want that right here. And I was like, all right. So I canceled the deal. So you got to do your research. Yeah. So basically, so when you buy them, you're literally like, you know, going to the neighbors and knocking on the doors and be like, hey, listen, you know, this is who I am. This is what I do. You know, this is how you know, it works and this is how we like monitor everything type of deal. That's exactly what we do. And we bring them in the house and we show them these are the cameras, there's noise meters, there's all these different tools.